what fungicide should I use to treat a rose bush? And this is Patrice from Cumberland, Maryland. So I have a couple of questions for Ms. Patrice, right? So when we're talking about rose bushes, what diseases are we talking about specifically? Mm -hmm. right? Black spot, we know is a major problem with roses, right? A major fungus of roses. So if it's black spot, you can use copper-based fungicide. Mm -hmm. Or neem oil is something else you can use. Okay. Or could it be powdery mildew, mm -hmm. which has to do with you know, humidity, right? Um, so with powdery mildew, you can use sulfur mm -hmm. or neem oil. So I'm all about using the low-impact pesticides. Mm -hmm. There's also rust. So rust could be an issue too, right? So if it's rust, again, you could probably use copper-based fungicide, neem oil. Yeah. So it depends on what disease we're talking about. Yeah. But those are the three major diseases of your rose bushes. Right. right. Now, if it has rose rosette, you're in trouble. Yeah, you have to dig that out, but yeah. Yeah, sometimes so you, think, you can um, maybe thin out your rose bush a yeah. little bit too yeah. to help you know, when everything's touching, then everything's spreading, and, and you're not getting the airflow, maybe it might be getting too moist in there. So right, I would agree with that. Maybe thin out a little bit. Yep, thin it out a little bit. Uh, and as far as controlling, like, all three with one fungicide, I mean, I would always go with something like neem oil. I would, Because too. it has fungicidal properties. Right. Right. That are good right. for black spot or any type of fungal leaf spot, mildews, and things like that. Mm -hmm. right. So I think that'll work. That's my go-to. That's the go-to, Jesse. <laughs> So I think it works.